Roger with us, I'm Justin Mormoth. We're told this happened this morning at a home in the Golden Grove Mobile Home Park in St. Cloud. News 6 reporter Amanda Castro is there with the tragic details. Fire crews were spotted within minutes. They were actually working a vehicle fire about a block away when the call came in, and that's when they started seeing the smoke coming from the mobile home. We're told even though they got here as fast as they could, an 11 year old boy didn't make it. You can see in this video, the mobile home on Lime Drive is fully engulfed. Neighbors told to go back into their homes. Flames were coming. You heard the, the explosions. It was bad. It was it was loud. It was it was terrifying. Across the street, Angel Abello had just arrived to work around seven o'clock this morning when he heard someone screaming. Lady was screaming how my, my son little girl was screaming to whatever dog on her hands it was I mean I'm still nervous about it like it gave me chills and everything several people called 911 and it turns out fire crews were about a block away working another fire uh, I hear people screaming and I went outside I just smell things I could see like like uh, you know flames in the air and it's in the back of the park St. Cloud police and fire responded within minutes, but it was too dangerous for them to rescue the three people inside the home. A good Samaritan tried breaking windows to help, but he was injured. Two people made it out and were told an 11 year old boy died in the blaze. Fire officials calling this the first fatal fire in St. Cloud in more than five years. There's no training for this. Um, there's no training for fire fatalities. It's, it's just one of the unfortunate parts of the job. The state fire marshal is investigating what caused this fire. We're told they can't rule anything suspicious out until that investigation wraps up. Reporting in St. Cloud, Amanda Castro, News 6.